What is going on, my super sandwiches? Rockstar here. Today brings us more Dragon Ball Legend summons. I feel like we were just here, like literally, like three or four days ago. Cause we were. Come on, Dims, Bandai, slow it down. Like you guys are dropping way too many banners. Good news is you can skip these. You can absolutely skip these two units, a hundred percent. I know Twitter, like last night when these cards officially were revealed, we're all like, oh, they're so good, they're broken, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not. I'll be real with you, they're not. At least in my opinion, I don't think they're great. <laughs> they're great. I mean, I'm saying that now. Maybe if I get the cards and actually play with them, I might have a different opinion. But, like, to kind of go over the cards real quick, they're not that great. So, basically, Broly's ability is equivalent to God Vegeta, where if you tag in and do a cover change, you reduce damage to 50%, and you can actually knock your opponent back if it's a strike attack. So, basically, just like Vegeta, with the exception of having a uh, slow recovery inflict added to the enemy as well. The other ability he gets is every time he enters the battlefield, he will draw a blue card, which he can do two times. And then his blue card just basically does... Uh, Massive explode damage, which, which also adds a plus 50% damage inflicted for 15 seconds, which also isn't that great. Just, it's just a standard blue card. His green card nullifies attacks except for Rising Rush, and then uh, also knocks him back, and then adds a couple of uh, boosts. He's not that great. I don't know why people are saying he's like crazy. <laughs> he's, he's just he's whatever. And this is not me saying that because I don't like this over this Broly. He's just not that great. His stats are fairly average as well for. Uh, the cards have been coming out, so I, I don't know. I, I don't see him. Maybe you guys can explain to me what it is about him that he's so great. Cooler, as much as I love Cooler and Lineage of Evil, he's also not that great, unfortunately. He's pretty skippable, but in my opinion, I think he has a much better kit than Broly, uh, which sounds weird because I feel like he's worse than Broly, if that makes sense. His green card uh, will basically add a um, a boost to you. does a, a attribute downgrade for 20 seconds on your opponent and also destroy their cards. I think that's a great card. Anytime you can kill your opponent's hand, it's fantastic. I wish this, this would also reduce the draw speed, which would make it like crazy, but it doesn't. But hey, I mean, I'll take it for what it is. His blue card uh, just basically reduces key on hit, which, uh, which I think is also, also great. Basically, anything that lets your opponent, uh, stops your opponent from attacking and doing anything is fantastic. As far as his regular abilities, he does the analysis complete where every time he enters the field, uh, he does plus three. When, when his character is on the field, Every time your opponent does a strike card, a blast card, it adds a plus three cost uh, for 15 seconds. Now, I assume this can stack, meaning if they do like five uh, or four or five strike cards with like sidestepping everything, that should add, you know, plus three every single time for the cost, which would obviously reduce it and make it so they can't actually do combos in the long run, I think. I think this is great. Metal bo body, uh, every time he enters the field, he recovers health by 5%. And then plus 30% uh, to damage inflicted. And then he also plus 30% to own key recovery and he destroys a random card. I think Cooler is actually better as far as his kit. His Z ability is whatever. And his main ability basically just restores health by 20% and then takes away any attribute changes. So yeah, I think Cooler is better. Uh, but honestly, you don't need either one of these cards. I mean, I still much rather run Lord Chilled instead of Cooler. And I guess that Broly, you have other options because there's so many Saiyans you can choose from or movie-based characters. So yeah, let's go ahead and hop in. We're going to do basically just 9,000 crystals and then uh, call it a day. If I don't pull the units, whatever. If I pull the units, great. But uh, I'm mostly just waiting for the anniversary. So I'm going to tell you right now, wait for the anniversary. It's coming up literally around the corner. Save your crystals. Get to farm and do whatever you need to do. Don't summon on this banner. And before, like, you know, this card is actually, these two cards are actually a lot better than I'm just, you know, overanalyzing. And, and like a couple weeks from now, it's like, oh, you should have summoned on it. I don't know. I'm just giving you my opinion. You guys can summon if you want. It's up to you. I usually only tend to summon on, on banners based on uh, the characters that I like. So if they ever drop another Beerus, I'm going to go ham for it. If they drop another Gogeta, which will happen inevitably, I'm going to go ham for it. If they drop characters like, you know, like, like this Broly, I'm just not really going to care for them. Unless they do a lot of crazy stuff, in which case, I don't think he's that great. Whatever. Just my opinion, you know. If, if anybody gets uh, offended by my opinion, I don't know what to tell you. But I'm, this is just just how I how I see these two units. And remember, I like Meta Cooler. I like Cooler a lot. So I would love to see Cooler do something, but I just feel like this card just ain't it. Because I mean, I think the most efficient lineage of Evil team is definitely going to be still Lord Shield, Final Form Cooler, and then Yellow Frieza. But good news is you can technically run this um, Cooler as a support character. And, uh, you know, he, he'll boost all the other Lineage of Evil characters. So he, at least he can be on the bench. He, he can kind of be on the team. Okay, so that's two uh, Sternum Punches now. And, uh, oh, we actually got a Sparking this time. <clears throat> Fantastic. Fantastic. I actually didn't see what's in the banner. So I'll have to uh, double check here in a second. Or I guess we'll find out whenever this pull finishes. it. But hopefully I can... I, just give me the cooler and I'm done. I, <laughs> I really don't want the Broly. I just don't care. Not Again, he's not bad. He's just not as fantastic as everyone was making seem out to be. And with the fact that there's so many good sands already in the game, I feel like I'd much rather run another sand 
than this Broly. On top of that, come on, man. I mean, I get it. Yeah, I gotta revisit old cards. Uh, why is he in a banner? Why is he in a banner? Of course, you gotta revisit old character designs, but I would much rather, you know, like the new Broly design. This one's whatever. Really? Why was why was he? Oh, he's, wow, seven stars. I guess he was kind of worth it. He's gonna be actually, ooh. Yeah, that seven star ability is gonna further power up my squad. What is in his banner? Is, is Ginyu really in his banner, or is this one of those things where they have like the, the random units again? Oh, I think that's what it is. It's one of those banners. Looks like they brought that back. Ah, whatever. It's, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Okay, let's hop back in. Let's hop back in. So, <laughs> but at least you got a spark in. Yeah, did I really though? Was it worth it? Was it worth it? Ow. Can I get some red? Oh, that's better. I was about to say, can I get some red skies? But not, you know what? Tau's a little bit better. Bardock? No Bardock, that's fine. This is the part where I get another old sparking. <clears throat> I mean, uh, the, the old... The general sparking pool sometimes can be better, because I mean, when it comes down to it, uh, it just more more rate thing. So right now, I think uh, what they're saying is is you have a 32% chance to get one or two new units uh, with 16 point like six seven percent per units. What we got? <laughs> Losers. Other times this is gonna happen. Other times that's gonna happen. But instead of getting the same two or three sparkings that are in the banner of the older units, you now have a bigger pool. But still, man, I, gotta, I don't know. I don't know. I just, I just, uh, I just think this game is releasing banners way too fast. But the good news is, at least this is definitely one of the more skippable ones. Nothing else. Wow, nothing else. So yeah, save your crystals. Just wait for the anniversary, and then you know we'll we'll go ahead whenever that gets released. You know what? Something I was thinking about. So I, I in my last video, I, I mentioned you know what do you think is going to be the anniversary units, and uh, I ain't surprised you didn't see that many people say this, but I saw a couple say, what if it's blue Goku and blue Vegeta? And now that I think about it, it could very well be that as well. It could 100% just be Blue Goku and Blue Vegeta. I mean, I feel like Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, they sound like better anniversary units to release on an anniversary event. But at the same time, we haven't gotten Blue Goku and Blue Vegeta yet, so like that could also be potentially what they release. So, what do you guys think? Again, what do you think is going to come out for the anniversary? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm still expecting like Vegeta. We got to get Vegeta. I feel like it's kind of weird that Dimps and Bandai is letting Regen just run so rampant right now. They're so good. They're so good. Like, they're, they're dumb good. And, and nothing's being done about them. Like, uh, if you guys remember, when Super Saiyan 3 Goku came out originally back in uh, November, he literally shut down the Regen meta, which wasn't as powerful as it, w as it is today, but it was still pretty powerful back then. It, they really literally shut down the Regen meta for about, I want to say, a couple, couple of months, actually. <laughs> so Vegito, when he comes out, he's going to have to be dumb. He's gonna have to be dumb. He's gonna have to have some kind of ridiculous boost that makes you terrified to run region. So I'm curious to see how that's gonna go. But at the same time, if they release Vegito, I feel like we can also see something like a Boo, like a Buhan, or even a Kid Boo to go along with it. So it would also kind of further power up uh, region just to make it, you know, like a back and forth type of thing. Because they don't want to completely kill our team off because that could be problematic down the, down the road. But like, I mean, but Super Saiyan 3 Goku, he's still used to this day. To this day! So, like, whatever comes out is going to be used months down the line for the anniversary. So, save your crystals for that event. Speaking of saving my crystals, I probably should have saved my crystals on this banner because this has been boo-boo so far. I saw a, a, a pretty terrifying tweet this morning that was like, Yeah, I spent 9,000 crystals and got no sparkings. I think it was Zenrot. Much love to Zenrot if that was you. Oof. And I read that and I was like, watch that be me. But at the same time, I also just don't care about this banner. So, like, whatever. I'm just kind of summoning because, you know... I want to give you my own thoughts on the units, and again, I'm a completionist. I'm to the point where I played this game so long that uh, I want all the units just to like complete like the the circle of uh, of my collection, I guess. So yeah, we're gonna we're just gonna we're gonna want to done this. We're gonna want to done this and call it a day, uh, and we'll see what happens. And so far, what we're gonna see is is pull nothing. <laughs> we're gonna pull nothing. There was no small pot here, was there? Let's see if he dies. Okay, he didn't die anyway, so it doesn't matter. I was gonna say, can we get a potential fake out here? But no, nah, we're not. We're not. Dude, they're releasing banners way too fast. I, I don't understand it. Like, I don't know if they're just trying to keep up with, like, the revenue or something, but it's kind of weird. Like, this game is great when it comes to being free-to-play. They release so many crystals, which would be fine if they didn't release a banner every, like, six days. <laughs> because at this point, even if it, the game gives you, like, you know, eight to 10,000 crystals a month, it doesn't really matter because there's so many banners to pull from. So, uh, I, guess, I guess to the people who are free to play, just stay tuned to the YouTubers that you watch and kind of like listen to what people say and recommend as far as like if you want to go in. I'm going to tell you right now, skip the Metal Cooler and Broly banner. I'll be real with you. I'll be real with you. I saw a lot of people saying don't don't skip it, but hey, skip it. Trust me. Skip it. You don't need them. 
and wait for uh, wait for this anniversary event to come out. Unless, of course, like I said, if you like Metacool a lot as a character and the old Broly, by all means, go for it. Yo, can we get a fake out on this one? Because we got one pod and small letters. Wait, was it small letters? I think it was small letters. And dead Goku. All right. <clears throat> this could be potentially a fake out. So far, we've gotten two fake sparkings. We had uh, the Goku and we had the Ginyu. So let's see what happens here. I think I'm supposed to get like an extreme unit first. And it is extreme unit, which means sparking. Sparking. No, not yet. Are you going to spark for me? Sparking. Oh, maybe not. Maybe this is not going to be a sparking uh, multi. Yeah, I don't think it is. No, it's not. Come on. You know what we're going to do? We're going to back out here for a second. We're going to do a group summer because I have not done my dailies yet. Even before I pulled a new unit out here. You want to hop in with me? You know what to do. My count is down, and then you can let me know in the comment section below what you pulled, whether good or bad. I want to know what you pulled. Here we go. My count is down, and then I'm going to go through my other dailies and just kind of skip it just because I, I saved them for the video. Oh, great. This is going to be awesome for me from the looks of it. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Let it go. I'm going to skip. This is going to be trash. Let me know what you pulled, though, in the comment section below. You can tweet me at RyanStyle, tag me on Instagram, whatever social media you use. Uh, let's actually kind of power through with this. Honestly, I think, uh, what was it? I think this banner is even better than uh, than the other one. This is the only one I would say, you know, think about not skipping. I mean, you could skip Gotenks and Boo, uh, but they're both great. They're, I put it this way. Gotenks and Boo, in my opinion, are better than Broly and Metacooler. That makes sense. So if you want to go for something right now, go for those. Even Rebrian is technically fantastic. Um, but I don't like Rebrian's character, so I refuse to use that character on, on a team. Ooh, oh, it's just going to be an extreme. I got an extreme Freezy Pop. Uh, I think I got one more banner left. Maybe two? Oh, we got two. I, I, I forgot these characters even came out. I'm going to be real with you. Again, more units that they just released that no one really cared about. They were still great, but it's like they're so forgettable. And we're going to skip on that as well. One more. I think I have the Massive Pack uh, Daily Summon, and that should be it. I sh that should be it for now. Let's scroll down over her. And uh, there you are. Let's see what we get. Uh, I, I think at this point, there's nothing that I really need in this banner. I mean, I'll almost take copies of Bardock. No, Bardock, I think, is still for me is five stars, but we'll walk away with a Hero Roshi instead. All right, last two multis. Last two multis. Let's scroll all the way back up, and let's see what we got. If I get a bad animation, I'm probably just going to skip it, to be honest, because, you know, I, I'm kind of I'm over this banner already. Here we go. Oh, yeah, I have a guaranteed sparking as well. D don't let me forget to do that. I almost forgot to do that. Here we go. That's what I want to see, but no trunks, unfortunately. I was hoping to see trunks pop out just so I can get that guaranteed Bardock. You're not my dad. Oh, no Bardock. Guaranteed animation that uh, we'll get something new here. Ooh, but it's going to be guaranteed. Now, because I didn't get a new animation, I feel like this is going to be an old sparking unit. So, oh, Super Saiyan 3! Still doesn't count towards a new unit. I feel like this should. If you see Super oh, Saiyan 3, fuck. Goku, it should definitely confirm you're getting a brand new unit. I don't know why they didn't do that. They did that for Bardock and Trunks, but not for Goku for some reason. <laughs> Whatever. All right, what's it going to be? Remember, we have a waited chance to get the new units, but does it really matter at times? What we got? I did say I want Bardock. <laughs> I did say I want Bardock. I guess I'll take that. <laughs> wow. Another one. Oh my God. I am. I'm upset. I'm kind of upset. <laughs> I'm so. I'm so. I'm so. I'm so hurt at that. Hey, six star Bardock finally. Awesome. Okay. What are we what are we dealing with now? I actually. I always want to know what his stats are at uh at six stars. So we got eighty nine thousand strike, eighty two thousand blast. Okay, it's pretty good. Pretty decent defense as well. All right, whale mode Bardock. Uh, last multi, and then we'll finish it up by doing a guaranteed sparking, and hopefully it'll be something new, preferably the cooler. Because like I said, I'm over it. Oh come on, let's let's let's, let's just skip this. Yeah, look at that trash. Okay, last uh, summon of the video, and then we'll end it. So if you made it this far and you enjoyed the video, and you haven't hit that thumbs up yet, then why not hit that thumbs up right now? Go for it. Because I don't know, like the video, comment. I, I don't know what YouTubers always say. All right, last summon. What we got? There's the Dragon Balls. No new animation. Maybe a Bardock will pop out in this next spot right here. No Bardock. <sighs> oh, yeah. I mean, it's cool to get the instant transmission. But now we're just going to walk away with another Blue Fist Goku. Watch this. Ready? Blue Fist Goku. Oh, cooler. Hey, even better. Yeah, we're done here. Today was a good day. <laughs> the one card I actually won it. Cool. All right, well, actually, let's, 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 let's look at the animation, because, you know, this man is... Oh, ooh, okay, that's kind of nice. I like that a lot. Look at that, look at that. 
Anyways, thank you guys for watching. My name is Ramsaw. Let me know your thoughts on Cooler and Broly. Which one do you like the most? Are you going to save for your anniversary? Yada, yada, yada. And other than that, I hope you enjoyed the rest of the day. My name is Ramsaw. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.